Hello students, welcome to lecture series of automobile engines. In today's session, we are going to learn about what is a difference between SI and CI engine. That means we will learn what is a difference between petrol engine and diesel engine. Fine. So without wasting much time, let's start our video. So basically, you know that there is a major difference in, in type of construction that is in SI engine we are using a spark plug and in CI engine we are using fuel injector, exactly. So it was not the only difference, there are many differences in it. So let me show you one by one how it matters, fine. So let's start, before moving to difference, let me show you some uh, simple working. So you can remember what we have learned earlier, fine. So you can see in SI engine side, in this case, four strokes will be done, fine. So in this four strokes, what will be happening? In power stroke, we are using spark plug, fine. And in intake, we are taking air as an inlet and fuel as an inlet also. So we are taking air and fuel mixture as an inlet. Now in diesel engine, that is in CI engine, you can see that we have used injector. And in that case, we are taking only air as a inlet fine so that was a major difference that is a basic difference between them let's see other difference how it works fine so let's start for taking the difference we will take this three terms that is particular means which is the term which we are talking about in terms of differences thereafter we will do two parts si engine and ci engine fine so in case you are writing in exam you also need to write in this same manner first is particular Second is SI engine and third one is CI engine, fine. If you want to take a note down, you can also take a note, fine. So let's start. So the first point that is a meaning, that means what is SI? It is a simple spark ignition engine, that means it is petrol engine. And what is CI? That is a compression ignition engine and we are knowing it as a diesel engine also. So in case in exam, it is asked that what is the difference between SI and CI or what is the difference between petrol engine and diesel engine? fine so both will be similar in many case so you can write this difference also in both of them fine so let's start let us move to the second point that is a definition so what is the definition of si engine that means it is an engine in which the spark is used to ignite the fuel spark is used to ignite spark and ignite so it is called spark ignition engine fine and what is ci engine so in this term, we, which, uh, which, uh, we are using the heat of compression, right? So it is an engine in which the heat of compressed air is used to burn the fuel. So that is a major difference. That is a basic difference. And we can understand it in definition, fine? So two differences are already done. First, it's meaning. And second, it's definition, fine? So let's move to the third difference. That is a fuel used, so simple, in SI engine, we are using petrol as a fuel and in CI engine, we are using diesel as a fuel. Air is actually mixing with both of them, so air is not actually fuel. Fuel means which is combustible, fine. So we are using petrol in SI engine and we are using diesel in CI engine. Next is what is operating cycle, means on which cycle this engine works, fine. So you all know that on petrol engine or in SI engine, basically that auto cycle is working. In auto cycle, you understand there are two constant volume process, fine. In diesel engine, there are, there is a diesel cycle. That means in that one is constant pressure and one is constant volume. So we are doing that uh, diesel injection at constant pressure in a diesel cycle and we are doing that spark at constant volume in petrol cycle. Now, why this is the difference? Because when we are taking a fuel and air mixture in petrol engine, we are not adding anything until the cycle ends. I'm repeating. When in petrol engine, 
we are using add plus fuel mixture from the starting so we are not adding anything so it will remain constant so volume remain constant fine now in diesel engine why we are not taking constant volume because in a diesel engine we are adding air first then we are injecting diesel in it so when we are injecting diesel it will increase volume so we cannot take constant volume so in that case we are taking constant pressure fine because temperature is always changing in combustion so we have only one term remaining that is pressure so in that case for understanding we are taking a constant pressure process in that engine so it is a fourth point that is operating cycle which is auto cycle in petrol engine and a diesel cycle in diesel or ci engine fine next is compression ratio now what is compression ratio it is a ratio before compression and after compression so it is a ratio of volume which remains inside cylinder fine so in si engine we are using lower compression ratio to operate an engine we are using higher compression ratio in diesel engine a u and u all know that in almost a uh, ratio that is 8 as to 1 to 12 as to 1 that is in petrol engine and in diesel engine we are taking 15 as to 1 to 20 or 22 as to 1 in a diesel engine fine so that is only for your information you only need to write these two points only that is low compression ratio and high compression ratio next is thermal efficiency now why thermal efficiency because this is the main term which is giving a performance fine so thermal efficiency of petrol engine is higher and thermal efficiency of diesel engine is actually lower than petrol engine fine so it is also one more point and uh, next point is method of ignition now which method we are using to ignite the fuel so in this case we are using spark plug so we are using spark ignition in method in this and besides that in a ca engine we are using compressed air fine so the compressed air is used for the ignition so this point can be also important in terms of ignition fine i am repeating all again meaning is si and ca spark and compression ignition thereafter its definition thereafter fuel used petrol and diesel thereafter operating cycle auto and diesel thereafter compression ratio in this a lower in ci it is higher thereafter thermal efficiency so higher in petrol lower in diesels and thereafter method of ignition so we are using spark plug and we are using compressed air fine so these are the basic difference let's move to the other differences thereafter one more is engine speed so engine speed is generally it is actually in starting condition so engine speed is actually higher in petrol engines yes in si engine and it is comparative to that lower in diesel engines thereafter what is a pressure generation so in petrol the pressure is lower because a compression ratio is low and in ci engine the pressure will be higher because compression ratio itself is high fine let's move to the next that is constant parameter during the cycles which parameter is remaining constant so i already explained you in petrol engine volume is constant in diesel engine pressure is constant so we are taking constant volume cycle in si engine and in ci engine we are taking constant pressure cycle thereafter what is a intake means in inlet stroke or in suction stroke what is going inside cylinder fine so it is a intake point though in that case si engine will intake air plus fuel in a diesel engine we will take only air as an intake we are talking about inlet stroke only fine so in si or petrol engine it is air and fuel in a diesel engine it is only air next point is weight of the engine now what will be the total weight of engine because in si engine it is actually a low capacity engine we already know and we need some less parts with compared to diesel engine fine so in that case si engine will have less weight ci engine will be heavier than si engine for the same capacity of the engines fine next is noise production now which engine produce noise in which the pressure will be higher the noise will also be higher fine now see this is a pressure point pressure is lower in si so noise will also be lower in si engine pressure is higher in ci engine so noise will also more in ci engine simple you can understand it this way next is production of the hydrocarbons now what is hydrocarbon it is an exhaust which is going outside 
so it is a gas which is formed during the combustion process fine so what is the production of hydrocarbon in petrol engine the hydrocarbons are produced very less in a diesel engine it is produced higher fine so these are all the points only we are uh, only i'm repeating you the main particulars that is engine speed petrol high diesel low thereafter pressure petrol low diesel high thereafter constant parameter in petrol that is constant volume in diesel it is constant pressure thereafter inlet valve or intake stroke air plus fuel in petrol engine only air in diesel engine thereafter weight of engine that is petrol engine are lighter diesel engines are heavier thereafter noise production so petrol will do less noise diesel will do more noise and last is hydrocarbon production so petrol will produce less diesel will produce more 